Hey what's up guys Shubham here and today we're gonna play some games in this uh, Sony Xperia E4G because uh, this is a gaming review so let's get started so now we'll start from uh, some casual games for example uh, this is a subway surfer so we'll start from this and it's a very popular game uh, so and as you can see it loads pretty quickly yeah as you can see it loads pretty quickly so let's play Even there are lots of uh, smartphones in the market uh, who lags between in this game also they get uh, very laggy or something like that. There are lots of uh, drop frames in this game also in some of the smartphones in the market we are that are really cheap in the quality. But this device doesn't this is pretty smooth device and no lags or something like that. It's pretty smooth and obviously it's a casual game so not lots of graphics are there but then too it's uh, pretty popular and also there are some interesting graphics so and uh, as we talk about the display quality the uh, viewing angles are also pretty good as you can see you can uh, view it from any angles uh, there is a window out there so you might see the reflection but then to the uh, screen is pretty good as also uh, as it's it is not having the uh, HD display or anything like that it is just a simple uh, QHD or something like that QHD display so we'll just quickly move out of this game and let me just quickly move out of this game yes i already done that and let me just quickly remove this and we'll play temple run so for just a minute or so because this is almost similar to the subway surfer but some graphic changes are there in this game so anyway let's play this game it's almost similar like Subway Surfer, but there are uh, the animation is some different, uh, the graphics are different. So we'll play for just a minute or so. Oops, sorry. Sorry guys, I'm always falling down. So this is the last time. If I die, then I'll just quit the game quickly. And as we talk about its sound, uh, sound quality, the sound is uh, pretty good. Uh, almost loud I would say not that much but it's okay for its price range as you can see the sound quality is coming out from the single speaker at the back I'll show you in just a while let me just finish this stage and the motion graphics or you can say the gravity graphics also uh, the G sensor also works pretty smoothly so all the sensors are pretty smooth in this device and uh, there is no lags in this tempo run also yeah so let me just move this 
and proceed to the another game that is dead trigger let me just close the uh, running application and I'll just go to the dead trigger 2 uh, this has much uh, much better graphics and anyways it's trying to play right now it needs internet connection so yeah I enable the uh, Wi-Fi and it is going to connect right now yeah it is now connected as you can see on the top Wi-Fi is connected so and the speaker is at uh, the back the single speaker and it works fine I would say anyways it's now starting yeah and guys I already uh, played some of its uh, missions so let me start from the first level or I would say I'll continue where I was last time and I'll just play the volume I tried to the full and here's the game itself it has the uh, good graphics but as of now it's not the latest game there are lot lots of games there with much better graphics but to test the device uh, graphic GPU or its performance this is also a pretty good device to check and to enjoy the game also So this level is pretty tough because I reached lots of level and this one is pretty tough because there are lots of zombies are there. Oh I died, I'll, uh, let me just retry and after that uh, I'll just proceed to the another game. So as you can see in this game also there is not uh, the drop frames or any leggy legginess in the game. Uh, this game is also pretty smooth as of now. Uh, and as before I forgot to tell you about its specification. It has 1 gigs of RAM as you know already I think so. And uh, it has Mali T760 GPU. So the graphic card is also uh, good I would say not the excellent the RAM is 1 gigs of RAM 1.5 GHz processor uh, that is MediaTek 6572 or something like that yeah I am uh, I am correct I would uh, I think I am correct the 1.5 GHz MediaTek 6792 processor uh, and uh, about its battery, I'm not sure, but I think it is 2400 or something like that. And as its sound quality, I already told you, it's pretty good. And if we talk about its size uh, to hold, in my opinion, the size is uh, okay. -ish. Uh, it has 4.7 inch display so it's good to hold in one hand and the single hand operation is pretty easy to do uh, and it looks uh, great in your hand but it's not uh, as much thinner I would say it's pretty uh, wide or thicker 
but anyways so let me just uh, quickly move out of this game after killing that biggest zombie okay one more left mm, he itself killed her so that's it this is the uh, dead trigger 2 and finally the last but not the least the game is uh, highly popular and it has much 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 better graphics than all we played till now uh, the name is uh, there is lots of uh, high-end devices uh, which gets lots of lags lagginess or uh, something like that and uh, we'll just uh, see how it performs in this device so the name is asphalt 8 so let's just play this asphalt 8 and actually this is my favorite game because I love car racing games and this is the asphalt 8 the approximately size of this game is 1.5 gigs so you can freely download it from play store so I recently download this and playing it first time in this device in front of you so these are the advertisements skip this and just check this one Click next and there is something no the option there yeah, also put this only and it's trying to load yeah as you can see and we are playing the nevada level of this so here we are going to start the racing so let me just first of all change its uh, graphic properties as well as its control uh, i just like this steering and the sensitivity i move to uh, 60% and just go back there and sound and display I would say sound I'll move to 100% to show you the sound quality of the speaker in this game and the graphic the graphics I moved to 100% so we'll just check how it performs in full graphics Oh my god so anyways uh, guys this is the first time I'm playing this game in this device so there is some uh, changes so let me just change its position the steering position you can change it easily so that you can play it well as your own choice so i'll try that And this game has the uh, best graphics. There are lots of games with the excellent graphics are there also, but this game also has much better graphics. And we'll just see is there any lag or not. As of now, there is nothing. Uh, I have I does not see any of the lags as of now, but we'll just see in its second level as well as the remaining level. So I'll try to drift and as you can see all the smokes the effect the smoke effect in the tires uh, if I'll try to drift 
as you can see all are uh, rendered as you can see pretty smooth gameplay I, I would say And as you can see the graphics are pretty good and I did not notice any of the drop frames as of now and if you guys can see in this video please let me know in the YouTube comment section if I missed any of the uh, lags because this is my first time oops this is my first time gameplay of this uh, asphalt 8 in uh, front of you guys so let me know in the youtube comment section that at what time i left the uh, uh, lagginess or something happens or and if i not notice that so please let me know that but as of now i am unable to notice that obviously i came to because this is my first time we'll just play one more level and We'll try to play one more level. And guys, I'm back uh, because I need to unlock this Tokyo level to play in front of you. And I was playing this game since 15 minutes, uh, the Nevada level. But anyways, I'm showing the timing because to show you that how much time I've take to play this game for the hitting issues or something like that but as of now the phone is only uh, a little bit of warmer but not that much heat happens in other sony phones or something other phones get so this is the tokyo level we are playing right now and so here it starts And as you can see, there are some lags in this uh, in this stage or this version, or to say that this level that the frames there are lots of drop frames in this version. It might happening because I was playing it since uh, 15 to 20 minutes or about the 20 minutes to 25, I, I would say. So it might happening because of uh, gameplay since lots of time uh, much more time happens more than 15 minutes span. So I think it might happening because of that. But anyways, uh, gameplay is fine I would say you can drift to get uh, the nitro I again get rigged There are some lags, but not uh, everywhere or every time. Every time, there are some lags, but overall the gameplay is smooth, pretty fine, I would say. And now it's not getting any lags. Sometimes it happens because of some heating, I would say. The device gets warm up a little bit much.
as you can see there is a, a lags there the game looks like it stops but for a second As you can see there is a lag uh, in the sound also uh, the effect sound effects get sometimes uh, lags which means it stops for one second and then again starts there is a minor lags here and there but overall it looks pretty fine pretty well I would say and again uh, resume for some reason uh, my camera stops but anyways and it's almost finished I would say yeah I finished the race and GP I came to sixth number the first from the last okay that's it guys uh, and device gets uh, much uh, warmer than before a little bit much warmer than before but anyways uh, as it's gameplay uh, I think some lags are there because the uh, dead trigger 2 is also running in the background so I forgot to remove it but anyways guys that's it this is the gaming review and uh, one more thing on the display the front panel this is of I think gla uh, this is of glass so this uh, looks much more it looks it heated up uh, not warm the back looks it is not heating up it's just like in the warmer side but on the front panel this is uh, extremely heating up but anyways after 510 uh, after one two minutes two three minutes if you uh, put your device as it is without playing any game just close all the multi multitasking and then again it will become normal and the temperature is dropping i would say it feels like unfortunately i'm not having the uh, heat gun so that i could show you the uh, exact temperature but anyways guys support me so that i could uh, increase my investment that's it guys thank you for watching this video i hope you like this content and uh, if you like this content click on subscribe uh, click uh, like click button and as always i would to say don't forget to click on subscribe that's it thank you this is shubham signing off thank you